Here we are with the Tech on Titan Season 4, Part 2, Episode 2. And yeah, last episode was very interesting. We don't know if Aaron is just going along with Zeke or if he is actually working with Zeke. And we have to see how the whole Malayne attack works out, right? Because right now it looks pretty bad for the aliens. And we have to see if Armin, Mikasa, Jean and Connie will work with Eren or against him. I mean, I guess they have to work with him, right? Otherwise they will die. And yeah, we also don't see or didn't see what happened with Levi. I mean, we know that he is, well, I guess he's pretty much alive, but in a bad shape. Um, so yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe or comment. Let me know what you think. And I would say let's get to the episode. Hey, yeah, how does she feel? She said she wants to, but it's probably because she is an Eka man. I mean, I guess not necessarily, right? I mean, she really... I mean, <laughs> I don't know. It could be that she really wants to because she likes Eren, because they know each other since childhood and he saved her. Or that is really just ingrained in her, right? Because something activated. It's like, I don't know. At this point, we don't know, I guess. I want to say it's more because she likes Aaron, right? <clears throat> yeah, I mean, we don't know, right? We can just speculate. From what we heard so far, it sounds like he wants to go along with Zeke in the plan. But maybe it's just so that he gets the help of Zeke and he has other plans in reality. It's very complicated. <laughs> Can you stop talking? Make up your mind. I want to leave here. <laughs> And still you helped. Oh, getting Mikasa. That's how it all started. That he was envious of Aaron having Mikasa around. I'm helping, but just so that I can, can beat the shit out of him later. To maybe protect you from, from getting involved? He knows that it's a messed up thing that it will be bad. Ah, <sighs> this was so long ago. Yeah, like I said, I could imagine that he just said that to maybe push them away, protect them. <clears throat> because he doesn't want to get them involved. Because they are the people that are the closest to him. 
the, the OST in the back. So calm. With all the shit going on on the screen. And blood and dead people. Oh, he is a man on a mission. Imagine he grabs him and choke slams him or punches him away. Dozens of people dead. <laughs> One punch. <clears throat> yeah, I guess he's very fast and strong, but also fragile. Dude, they have three titans attacking him, basically. One with a cannon. And, <laughs> and he still fights back. Breaks his jaw? Or imagine he rips off his head. Oh, what a scream. <laughs> what was that? It looked like a crystal ball. Oh, Zeke. Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> Daddy is home. He looks a bit shocked. And here goes the opening again. Aaron looks a bit shocked. I can't tell if he is like... <clears throat> if he is like... Shocked in the sense that he is like... Happy to see that he's now here to help him. Or if he is like... Shit, what is Zeke doing here? I don't want him here. Man, this intro is so good. <laughs> I really hope that they make the next opening song for the final. That would be dope. It's, from this intro here now, it seems like that maybe the girl that Zeke saw when he was recovering maybe will play a part later on, maybe? Dude. Ugh, this will be interesting. Sneak attack? Okay. Sneaky, sneaky. <clears throat> Does Zeke destroy the Zeppelins? He has a... Yep, range. Man down. And the next one, boink. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't think he will make it that easy. Yep. He takes aim. <coughs> there comes the next one. Flock and the others. 
Tables are turning. Yeah, dude, buildings can't protect you from this. <laughs> Not much, I would say. I don't think that that's the plan right now. <clears throat> Top of the class and can't do shit right now. Because she has no powers, no guns, and nothing. Dude, if the if Zeke is this close and he would scream, everyone that would have drank the wine would transform, right? <clears throat> yeah, I think they to be honest, I don't think they came here to save. Gabi and Falco, right? I think they're just here because they want the founding titan. And if they can get Gabi and Falco in the same swoop, then why not, right? Right? Get the fuck out of my way! I'm trying to save your ass. Yeah, he got fucked up. Mm-hmm. Oh, is this maybe the sneak attack that they, everyone that drank, will be the sneak attack because Zeke will scream and they transform? I missed that, I have to rewatch that part. Yeah, I guess because she's a bit conflicted. Because she's not certain of her emotions and Aaron right now, I guess. I think this is the first time that she's not wearing... <laughs> Praise the Beast Titan, destroying all the Zeppelins. <clears throat> I think the only times that Mikasa Dozens dead. Uh, didn't wear the scarf is probably when she took a shower and when she was hurt. Our savior. Imagine they attack each other. <laughs> That would be crazy. Oh, he recovered? Oh, Zeke, okay. <clears throat> I was wondering, who attacks him and has enough firepower? It's Zeke. 
Yeah. <clears throat> well, he had no other choice. Exactly, when and where he was supposed to. What is that face? Dude, I think there was the creepiest face I've ever seen in anime. <laughs> what the fuck was that face? I mean, Attack on Titan had some weird faces, right? But that... took probably the throne. <laughs> I have to rewatch that scene. Yes, Falco. act Not suspicious at all. <laughs> that he just goes there and then comes back <laughs> without going to a to a building. Well, not all of them are bad. Oh, oh. <clears throat> and the spiral continues of hatred. Exactly, she finally comes around. Exactly. Kinda true, he was a trigger, but I mean he didn't knew better, right? <laughs> Who, how would you know? Oh. Oh, oh, he's spilling the beans. Oh, he goes all out. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> no regrets. I think Zeke wouldn't care. <clears throat> uh oh. Get the fuck out away from Aaron. I, I have the feeling Aaron might attack him, maybe. Oh, she leaves the body, the Titan body. I think that's a diversion. They may be left and she will transform somewhere else again. There, that's what they do, hide in the smoke. Oh, and the cannon. That's a sneak attack. Can he recover from this? I think so. God damn. No. Dude, <laughs> everyone is hurt and down all the titans. Is Rhine attacking? It's you. Dude, the OST in the back. Oh my god. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, that was the episode. Let me know what you think. But yeah, man, this episode went by in a flash for me, right? It felt like it didn't took long. I guess that's maybe because a big part of the episode was basically what we've seen at the end of last episode, right? Um, so, yeah, I can't tell if Aaron looked shock in terms of cool, Zeke is here, he's helping me. Uh, or if it was like, shit, what is he doing here? But I mean, they said that he's at the right time. At the right spot, at the right time, right? So I guess it was planned, so you shouldn't be surprised. Mm. Still didn't see Levi, and I guess this will be interesting now how this will turn out. Zeke is still around, he's not dead yet, just hurt. And Galliard is down, Reiner could maybe start attacking Aaron, I guess. And Aaron tries to make his way to Zeke. But for what reason? Like, doing the plan? Like starting it now, touching and boom. Or maybe something else. Yeah. I don't know. And yeah. Then we had the scene with Gabi where she finally comes around and is like, dude, these are not demons. These are just people. We never knew them and we just had assumptions. Right? And... Falco spilling the beans that he is in love with Gabi and he's just pulling everything out because he doesn't know if he will transform into a titan or not. But I, they said, yeah, we could maybe tell Zeke and he wouldn't scream if he knows that you drank the spinal fluid, but I guess Zeke wouldn't care. <laughs> Zeke would scream anyways be because I would imagine that Zeke is like, this boy's life or everyone's life. 
well, we have to make one sacrifice, right? For the greater good. I guess that would be Zeke's idea, so he wouldn't care. Um, and yeah, the one girl, I forgot her name again, is like, she, Gabi was about to go out because she knows that they are not bad and want to go to them and thank them maybe. And then the other girl's like, yeah, I hate him. I want to kill him. They killed Sasha. <laughs> Which is the spiral of hatred again, right? Oh my god. But yeah, not much else to say about this episode, right? I didn't expect the sneak attack to be the car titan giving up the body so that they can make it look like as if they were defeated and then use that chance to shoot the cannon, which was pretty badass. Um, but yeah, didn't work quite out well, <laughs> right? I mean, would be too easy, but yeah. Um, I think that's all, right? So yeah, if you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know, let me know what you think. And I would say thanks for watching, until next time, bye-bye.